Alrighty, YouTube, it's your boys, Yuxus, and we're live with, you know, Tove. We've done testing for Tove, and I'm going to tell you guys right now, she is not worth summoning for whatsoever. She is a very, um, useless character, I want to say. Unfortunately, the reason why I say she's a useless character is because she's not necessarily helping you get anywhere. Yeah, she's helping buff up damage for some of these shotgun characters, but she's not really taking it to another level, right? Example, we tested her with like some of these shotgun DPSs and she's taking them from like, if you have her on the team and her not on the team, with her not on the team, they're hitting like 8 million. With her on the team, they're hitting 10 million. You know what I mean? So it's not that much of a jump where it's like, oh, I need to have this character. Not only that, there's a bit problems. There's a couple issues with this character. We're going to talk about it right now. So... First things first, do not summon. This is a skip banner, which is obvious, limited, and a New Year's Pilgrim most likely will be happening. So look at the chat up there. Up there, you guys know where the chat is. Look at the chat up there, and then just skip. It's as simple as that. Don't argue it, just skip. <laughs> Unless you're a collector, right? If you're a collector, do what you want. But if you just skip. It's as simple as that. Um, one thing about Tov. To get the 5% on that first skill, you have to get her first skill to a minimum of level 9. That's horrid, right? Um, beforehand, it's only going to be 4 and 3%, so it's not that much of a difference. Um, but then it's like, you know what I mean? One thing they definitely should have made it is that it was 5% the entire time, and then they just increased the reload speed percent. The fact that you have to get the first skill to level 9 so that there's a 5% chance of it proccing is not that crazy, right? Um, it's not that crazy. The second thing about this character is that um, the percentages for the what you want, like in terms of the crit rate and then also the crit damage and then also the first attack buff, they're pretty low. Um, when it comes to shotgun characters, her burst skill is just an attack buff. Right, and even with the mirrors, the stack, it's like, unless you fully invest into this character, why use her when you can just use another burst one with a better attack buff, like Red Hood or even, you know, Lit Her. Um, you know what I mean? So it's like, the burst skill, it's like, when you realize it's just an attack buff, it's like, you could just use another attacker, right? If you just want to have the attack speed buff, and that's it, you can use another burst one attack buffer. Right, the attack speed is cool and stuff like that, but again, it's not necessarily helping their damage go up by that much. Right, an attack speed buff isn't a damage increase buff in the sense of you're going to be doing more numbers, you're just going to be producing more damage out essentially. Right, so with an attack speed buff, in the okay, let me word it like this in the span of 10 seconds, with an attack speed buff. Right, I can get 20 shots out without the attack speed buff in the span of 10 seconds. I can get 10 shots out, right? So that's how the damage is increased. But overall, not really that crazy of a character. I mean, I'm going to show you guys some stuff, right? You can look at the chat as well if you want more opinions, um, right? Because they know just as much as me, right? It's not really worth it. We're going to try it right here with the Drake comp, right? So we're not actually going to be using her burst hero. We're actually just going to be taking her effects um, and then, yeah. I'm going to show you guys with and without her on the team for Drake. Um, we're going to do like a full 1 minute and 30 second run with her on the team. And then another full 1 minute and 30 second run with her not on the team. And then that's really it. Um, it's a bit disappointing because it's essentially just a dead week for 2 weeks in the sense of the unit. Right? But I mean, I'm not complaining because we just came from the anniversary. But I hope you guys aren't complaining as well. So... After the first burst skill rotation, only 9.5 million, right? Probably had 900k damage there, so not like, you know, anything. But again, I'm not expecting, you know, Tove to make Drake hit like Scarlet and Red Hood, right? I'm not expecting that of this unit, if you want to be honest. We don't have another burst 3 because this team is a big joint, I guess. So let me actually build a proper team. Alrighty, so I put on a more realistic team. Um, we have Isabel and Drake. We're going to do a full 1 minute and 30 second run with these two and Tove. And then we're going to do it again. Take out Tove, put in someone like Litter or Dorothy or whatever. And I'm going to show you guys the damage there. Right, so... Um, I mean, again, we're going to try to look before the burst skill, right? Um, of what the numbers are looking like before the burst skill from everyone. And then we're going to go from there. So, 
right now Drake is at 1 million and Isabel is at 1 million right after the burst skill with the school girls on the team by the way with the school girls on the team by the way um don't get it twisted the school girls on the team Drake is buffing right um they only went up by Isabel went up by nothing 5 million Drake went up by 8 million so not bad but that's again with the school girl support as well so I mean, again, I just hope you guys are not expecting these new characters to always make, these supporters to always make the units hit like Scarlet and Red Hood, right? I think that's one thing that you guys should just be aware of, but, you know, I probably should have had Isabel first just so that we can get her full thing off, but it's fine, um, because we don't really need to waste any more time with it, but overall, which is not a problem, right? I say it all the time, there's no problems for Nikkei to have a bad character, right? There's absolutely no problems for Nikkei to have a bad character. Now, I wouldn't say Tove is a bad character. I just wouldn't say she's crazy. Like, I would say she's a peak definite mid. Mid is a good word, chat. I think mid is a good word. And that's not in a disrespectful way. That's just how it is. She's just mid, right? Um... It, again, it's not in a disrespectful way, it's just the perfect word for it. Mid. Right? It's simple as that. Right? So let's take a look. After 1 minute and 30 seconds with Tove, right? Um, They both ended... Look, Naga ended up hitting the hardest on this team. Um, Which is okay. I mean, sure. 26, 29 million. Right? You can see these numbers. Look, Tove herself has 16 million. Tia has 13 million. Everybody else has 29, 26 million. You can see, right? Um, you know what I mean? You can see the, like, not necessarily the problem, but her not doing much, right? So we're going to run this exact same team just without Toast to see the difference. So 29 and 26 million. Alrighty, y'all. So we're back. Final run. We're going to run her with Litter. And you guys are going to see. I wouldn't be surprised if with Litter, they ended up hitting harder, right? Right, I wouldn't be surprised at all, right? But let's just take a look and see what it's looking like, right? So the first time it was 1 million to 9 million from Drake on the first burst skill. Let me see what it is this time around. So right now, 1.4 million, cool. And then boom. Okay, so again, she's attacking slower because she no longer has the attack speed buff. But let's see after 10 seconds. Um, It's slightly less actually. Okay, so you guys can see it's 2 million less, which is what I said at the beginning of the video, right? 2 million less. So, you, so you're only going to see like a short, like a small difference, right? I want to see. You're going to see a small difference. We're going to wait the 1 minute and the 30 second thing. Actually, for the people on the live stream, you guys are going to see it. For the people watching the video, I'm not even going to waste your time no more. I'm just going to pause it and show you guys the end result. Alrighty, people. We're back with the video. So that comes to the conclusion. So... With Tove, we had a total of 29 million for Drake, 26 million for Isabel. Without Tove, we had 25 million Drake, 20 million Isabel. So you can see it's not that much of a difference, right? It is definitely a difference. You're going to get more results with Tove, right? You are going to get more results with Tove because of the attack speed. And Tove is also giving you an attack buff as well, right? With the attack speed. You're going to see a difference. But it, for example, is a... 4 million is that a four? Yeah, is a 4 million difference for Drake and a 6 million difference from Isabel worth it? Probably not. So, not that great of a character, but again, that's not a problem. I hope and I pray to God that this community doesn't go ahead and say, Buff Tove, Buff Tove. I don't want to see that bullshit. I'm telling you guys right now, don't drag it. It's fine that she's not that crazy. Um, but yeah, you can see these numbers are basically the same thing all around. 29 million, 18 million. Like, it's just a small difference. It's just a small difference. Um, not that much of a difference. So, hopefully, guys, let me know what you think in the comments down below. Again, not a problem that Tove isn't great. It's not a problem at all. It's not a problem at all. They have no... They, Nikkei can have bad characters, right? We're not going to drag it to the point where we need to buff every unit that's da-da-da-da. It's fine that she's mid, right? It's not a problem. If you want to collect her, go ahead and collect her. But if not, then save for the limited and the future pilgrim. It's really as simple as that. Overall, not that great. I don't really like the fact that the first skill needs to be level 9 for the 5% chance. Everything else is just not really that great of a character. But it's fine. It's fine. 
So let me know what you guys think down below. It's your boy ZLTs, and I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace.